Hi, I'm uh, Tim Kadlik. I do developer relations at Sneak, uh, a company focused on making open source more secure. Um, we work with the Node Foundation. Uh, we are members. We also are involved in the security working group as well as the marketing committee. One of the biggest assets I think the Node ecosystem has is the vibrancy of the community. How many people are so passionate about Node and involved and by being part of the Node.js Foundation, we get to tap into that directly. We get to talk to other organizations, to other people that are using Node on a day-to-day -day basis that are trying to improve the Node ecosystem. Uh, and we get to find out what they're doing, what works for them, and, and sort of riff off those ideas and, and see what we can take back to better help the community ourselves. Um, so the Node Foundation just gives us a direct connection to all of these different wonderful companies and individuals that are contributing to making Node the vibrant platform that it is. So Sneak focuses on making sure that if there are vulnerable dependencies inside of any of your Node packages, um, we make sure that you're able to quickly fix those and get them out of the way so you can get on with your day-to-day -day work. I think what I love about Node and what I've always loved about Node from the very beginning is that um, it taps into a language that we've seen grown from. When JavaScript first came out, it was mostly almost a hobby thing, right? It was sort of jokingly named after Java. It was a barely a scripting language at all. Uh, and it's, it's grown since then and it's taken, uh, taken over. Uh, it powers incredibly complex modern applications. You know, you think about the things that we're building now versus the things we're building when JavaScript first came out. Uh, they're so much more complex. There's so much more code going on. You know, and JavaScript is everywhere. It powers the front end web. Now with Node, thankfully, it powers the server side. Um, we've seen it, it, it's inside of NASA code. It's being used by enterprises everywhere. Uh, and Node is sort of this equalizing language. It lets people who are building these applications on the front end, who historically have been, it lets them expand their reach into the back end now as well, um, taking advantage of the same thing that they're familiar with, the same language and the same sort of ecosystem, and have it span this full gamut of the, the website application, taking it much lower in the stack. And there's a lot of power in that. It really gets me excited um, because it, it extends what they can do. It makes us capable of doing much more with typical web standard technology, we can build incredibly complex things now. Um, and that, I think, is what gets me really fired up about Node, is that um, it taps into that existing knowledge, it taps into that ecosystem, it taps into that community, and everything that it do, does feeds back to the betterment of the web.